If you have an upcoming interview in two weeks or two months, you don't want to skip this video. Over the past few months, I have been chatting up with some of you folks and I have seen one major problem that is consistent amongst a lot of you. Let us say you have an interview coming up. Now, the major confusion that I have seen is you don't know what kind of a study plan you should make because you need to understand that, okay, this is the time I have available. So what problem should I solve? You cannot solve all the 3000 problems on lead code, right? And every company has their own areas to focus upon their own set of topics to focus upon. So how do you find out all of that? I know that to address this problem, there are some lists like the blind 75 list and the lead code grind list, but none of those lists are catered towards you. None of these are making a study plan that is directed actually at you. If you think about it, how would a study plan for you look like? You can say that, okay, I have five weeks available until my interview. Every week I can allot, let's say 10 hours of my time. So what problem should you solve? You shouldn't just target every problem. You want to look at the problems that are being asked by your target set of companies. Let us say you're targeting the top fan companies. So you want to focus on those type of problems. And similarly, there can be a certain set of topics you want to revise. It may be possible that, okay, you're fluent and very good with arrays, but you need more help in dynamic programming. You need more practice there. So your study plan should reflect all of that. Also, your study plan should be based upon your expertise level. If you're a beginner or you're an expert, based upon that, you need to understand that, okay, what kind of problem should I solve? So naturally what I did is I tried searching all over the internet for some resource, but I couldn't find any. So I decided to make one. Well, I'm proud to announce you the smart interview grind. And I call it smart because based upon your expertise level, it will decide how much time you want to allocate to each of the problems. And it is going to create a beautiful study plan for you. And naturally this study plan will have more chances to give you success in an interview. And just in a little while, I'm going to tell you everything about it, how to use this application and what can you get out of it. Hello friends. Welcome back to my channel. To keep things simpler, what I did is I created a web app. Now this URL can be accessed from anywhere and you can set up your study plan on any laptop. As soon as you open this, you will get two options, either a guided approach or an advanced approach. We will go over both of them. But first, let us try to go over the guided approach where we will create our personalized plan. As soon as you do it, the first question you are asked is, okay, what is your expertise level? So let us say you are just appearing for an interview for the first time. Then you are a beginner. If you have a few years of experience, you are an intermediate. Or if you are looking for the top tech roles, then you are an expert. So choose your expertise level. Let us say I am targeting an intermediate level. Now, how much time you have until your interview? As small as one week, all the way up to 20 weeks. So you get a lot of flexibility. Let us say I have an interview upcoming in six weeks. Now per week, how many hours can you give to yourself? Two hours per week, or you can go all the way up to 40 hours per week. So once again, it is giving you flexibility based upon your schedule. Maybe you do not get a lot of time. Maybe you get a lot of time. So let us say I can commit to about 16 hours per week. That seems reasonable, right? Once I have inputted all of these parameters, they will help me to decide, okay, how much time should I give to a particular problem? And you are going to see all of that. But first we need to understand what companies are we targeting? Are we targeting just like all of the companies? Maybe you are just making a study plan in general. You haven't got any interviews lined up or you're not targeting a specific company. So you want a good coverage of the problems asked from a lot of different companies. Or you are targeting the top tech companies like Facebook, Meta, Amazon, Google, all of these. Or you want to pick certain companies which you are targeting. Now notice that if I target all of these companies, I am going to get all of the problems that are asked in all of these companies. So let us say I am interested only in Microsoft. You can do that as well. Now you will get a study plan from all the questions that have been asked only in Microsoft. 
Similarly, let us say you are targeting Microsoft and Google. So now I have selected two companies. So it is giving you a lot of flexibility over here. For this demo, let us say I'm targeting all the top tech companies. Go on to the next step. This portion is also interesting. What topics do you want to focus on? All topics is pretty standard. You get problems from the entire mix that is available on lead code. You have high yield patterns, which you will see recurringly, like the two pointer approach, the sliding window and all of these things. Or you can also focus on specific areas. Let us say I only want to look at all of these problems. I'm not interested in backtracking or binary search or bread search search. I'm looking just at these particular topics. So again, you have a very good flexibility over here. For now, let us say that, okay, I want to look at all of the topics. That means I am preparing for a generic interview where I want to be comprehensive about everything. Go on to the next step. And this is the last step. What kind of a complexity do you want? So the standard mix is you get everything except the very hard problems. Because very hard problems can be sometimes demotivating. So I am focusing on very easy, easy, medium and hard. If that does not work for you, you can also choose. Maybe you want to skip out the very easy and the very hard problems. You are only looking at easy, medium and hard problems. So I have selected these three levels and I'm ready. Now the magic of AI happens and I will create my personal strategy. And voila, I get this lovely dashboard. Just look at all of this. Over here, I have all of the things that I selected. And now check it out. I got a very good topic distribution. These are all the topics that I will be covering. And I get a week by week schedule for each of the problems that I want to solve. And notice for each of the problem based upon your experience level, it will suggest you that, okay, you should spend about 10 minutes on this problem. You should spend about 21 minutes on this problem. So this is how your time factors in and you are preparing. So what happens now? Let us say you are picking this particular problem. If you can do it, very good. Otherwise, I have also included a video solution of every problem that I have the solution available. As I add more videos, you will see those videos appear over here. But for now, these are the videos that are available. Along with this, there is also more information available. For example, if you check out this particular problem, this problem has been liked by 66,000 people on lead code. So naturally it means that it is very, very important. And notice the other stack 135. This problem has been asked by 135 companies. So we selected all of these, right? But this problem is so important that people have seen it in 135 different companies. And all of this information has been scrapped from lead code. So you will find this information for every problem. For example, best time to buy and sell stock. It has been asked by 105 different companies and you will see the same pattern for every problem that is available. So now when you start to solve these problems, you can start to mark all of them one by one. And notice once you mark them as completed, your total progress starts to complete and you can keep a track of your entire schedule. This is your entire week one. So you are allocating 16 hours for all of these different problems. Then you have a week two, week three, and all the way up to the sixth week. And notice the problems are in an increasing order of difficulty. They start from very easy and they go all the way up to very hard, depending upon the complexity level that you have chosen. So this is giving you a very good comprehensive study plan based upon the parameters that work for you. And that is why I said that this study plan has been created for you and curated for you. And that is what makes it very, very important to keep things interesting. I have also added a dark mode if you prefer it, but this is an overall idea what this web app is all about. If you want, you can reset your progress and you can start over once again. Now comes the interesting part. What you can do is you can start over if this plan does not work for you. And you can create an entirely new plan that is more applicable for you. Otherwise, you have one more option available and that is the advanced approach. Now, this is a little tricky and I wouldn't recommend you going over there in the first attempt. Basically over here, everything is dynamic. 
let us say I have the experience level of a beginner. So I select this and all the problems will change dynamically. Now you can use these sliders to set up your schedule, all your weekly hours and your duration. After this, you can also select what level of problems do you want. Let us say I'm only looking for medium, hard and very hard problems. And now I can select all of the companies that I want. And notice there are 1400 problems available for Google, 1300 problems available for Amazon. Let us say I only want to look at problems that have been asked in Amazon. I select this and now I can do this for topics also. There are 785 problems on arrays, 301 problems on string, 295 problems on hash tables. So it looks like Amazon really likes problems on arrays, strings and hash tables. But let us say I want to practice dynamic programming and greedy approach. So what do I get? I get my new plan immediately. These are all the problems available and notice they start from medium because I selected it over here and they go all the way up to very hard problems. So once again, this is an advanced approach, but it works for you. And notice if you change your experience level, the time required for you to solve these problems will also change. For an expert, when you are very much experienced, it decides that, okay, you only want to give this much time for a problem so that you can have the maximum coverage and you can cover a broad range of topics. And just to reiterate, this smart interview grind works at every level. Let us say you are an intermediate, you have an upcoming interview in just one week and you can give only, let's say six hours. You want to focus on only the easy and medium problems and you're targeting Amazon. So you get your problem list. Just focus on these particular problems and you will have a very good thorough revision for the problems that are asked in Amazon for your upcoming interview. And needless to say, all the data available in this particular web app is backed up by the community data that is available on lead code. So if you see a lot of people liking a particular problem, that particular problem is ranked very much higher. So you can be sure that you are targeting a good number of problems and the very popular problems. You are not wasting your time looking at some of the problems that have a very low chance of appearing in your interviews. To access this app, all you need to do is go to this URL and you will need to upload a license. You can purchase the license from the link in the description below. And once you use and upload this license, this app will be available to you for life and you can use it anytime. It gives you lifetime access to every problem that is asked in all of these companies. So I believe this will give you a very good value. I really believe that this resource is going to help you a lot when you're targeting for your specific company or a study plan that is catered especially for you and you get lifetime access too. Also, do let me know what other improvements do you want to see in this app or what other features do you want to see? Once you have the license, this app will be regularly updated and you can use it anytime. Do let me know in the comment section what improvements would you like, what features would you like, what problems you are facing and I'll be happy to address all of them and I'll push out updates so your app will be updated automatically. Along with this, also let me know what other kind of materials do you want and what other kind of applications I can try to work upon that can help you in your programming journey or in your career in general. I will be happy to work on all of them with you and do make sure that you're subscribed so you do not miss any of these updates. And the last, I would like to give a huge shout out to all of the channel members who support my channel. You guys really keep me going and it is always motivating to see you guys. As a member, you do get priority reply to your comments and early access to new videos as well. Also, remember that you can schedule a one-to-one -one session with me and we can discuss about almost anything. You can find all of the relevant links in the description below. Stay tuned for my upcoming video. Until then, see ya.